I think, yeah, this, I like how I'm just called man. What are we looking, wait, what, what, what are we looking for? What are you, what are I'm, you this is the point where you have to get all the cages, so I just go back. So you're using a cheat mm -hmm. code? Yep. So I, you got hit. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why, every time you back up in, like, the menus, it just does that. It plays the hit sound effect? <laughs> the hiccup. <laughs> <sighs> Right, man. How much have you eaten today? <laughs> so you just so like is the Kadikus video correct? There's no is a in there's a in the PAL version that you can't go right to the end with a key code. Yeah, he said. Well, he said that there's there aren't any like cheat codes to get to the end uh, without getting all the cages on PAL. I found one. So sucks to be you, Kadikus. <laughs> So this one will take you straight to, to Mr. Dark? Yeah, it's a, what the, the code does is basically it gets, unlocks all the uh, uh, stages, like... It, it basically uh, makes it so all the cages are safe, so you don't have to worry about that, and it um, has it so, has it so the final level isn't beaten yet, because... One thing that kind of annoys me is that once you beat the final level, if you try playing it again after that, it's just gonna go to the credits. So uh, you're gonna have to play the game again if you wanna if you wanna play legit. So it's kind of stupid. I always I always hate it when games do stuff like that. One of the, uh, the candy chateau. <laughs> I love this. The no, no, well, the, the picture's pretty cool, but the, the, this level is like, you expect the, uh, like, uh, the... It's some kind of, like, evil Yeah, level. you expect it to be, like, really menacing, but it's like... And then, there's this. It's the most, like, over-the-top, like, non-final level, uh, visually, like, ever. <laughs> At least the cheat code also gives you 99 lives. Yeah, that's a nice bonus. Oh, look, that sounds like the original. It actually sounds like Rayman, how he does in like Origins. Mm -hmm. Ah! I right, speaking of, yeah, Glowbox also sounds pretty similar to Free in those games. Because mm. I, like, uh, I think sometimes when you when you get hit with Glowbox, he's like, whoa! <laughs> and it sounds so, oh! it sounds so similar to how he sounds in Free. Yeah, you're right. That damn it. What is that stuff right there? I don't know, but it hurts. <laughs> also, what? What it was it? <laughs> this place just makes okay. me hungry. Yes, yeah, sweet. It, Whoa! It's not sweet mountain bad, but <laughs> still. What did you? What did? What did Mr. Dark just do? Uh, he basically uh curses you a few oh. times throughout the level. So that time he get he basically makes Dark Rayman appear. Oh, this is. A... Uh, I don't think it's about to attack you. Mm. you well, you, yeah, you. If I why didn't you just attack you? <laughs> because reasons, I guess. Well, it's slippery here. Yep. Dark Rayman looks very different in uh, in Arena. Mm. I think in Rayman Legends he's completely uh, he's purple, I think. And he's a one-hit kill. Mm. Yep. Dun, 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 it's not. If you, if you know how to work around it, it's not too bad. Like if you. Is so it's just being, being like the shadow in the, the the cosmic clones in Mario Galaxy. Mm, yeah, but it's only one, so it's not too bad. It's just that if this one hits you, you're dead. Yeah. You have to be pretty clever. Like, think about what you did before and work around that. Cause it, I, I like how the game forces you to go, like, backtrack a little bit sometimes. So they, like, force you to, to shoot Ryan the Dark yeah. Rayman? Yeah, because if you didn't do that, Dark Rayman would not be an issue at all. Because mm. you just gotta keep moving. Yeah. Unless you stand still for, like, ten seconds for some reason. Ugh. Well, cause it looks like he's, at, like, he's always, like, three seconds behind you. Yeah. I got pretty scared here. <laughs> 
Like if you like 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 the moment if you stood still at all in three in probably exactly three seconds, three or two seconds, he'd catch yeah. you. Yeah, like as final level as far as final levels go though, I don't think this is really that difficult. It's probably one of the easier stages, honestly. They pro it's probably they probably did it on purpose. Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. Ugh. Unfortunately, no checkpoint. Yeah. So if you mess up, you have to go all the way from the start. Oh, there it is. And I think that's all of Dark Rayman. I f Where'd he go? Just, I don't know. He, 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 he got <laughs> off screen. Fuck. And now this curse is that we uh, move the opposite direction. So now your controls are reversed. Controls are reversed, right? yeah. Or is it just left yeah, and right? Just, it's just left and right. I don't, f I don't believe any other... Um, moves are changed around. So, this one's even easier than Dark Rayman? Um, arguably. Because, if just a, a left right platformer, it was, it was, it looks like these platforms, these platforms are a lot more generous than before, you mm. know? Yeah, because it's not slippery. Like, especially compared to the Cave of Scorps, or whatever his name was. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, if they threw in Dark Rayman in here, that'd be a different story. That's right. I love how it's just... They just, like, go go to town with the how over-the-top this is. Like, the circus-y music and all that. And the, just the... Look at that frick... Look at the yeah. background. Yeah, that teacup looks like something from Beauty and the Beast. Looks more like the, looks more like the pink elephant sink from Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Why did that exist? <laughs> Oh man. Infects your controller. There's a dark comes in and infects your controller. <laughs> yeah. I just like how they. I think there was something on the left. <laughs> I just like uh, how they did the complete opposite of what you expect from a final level. Always one step ahead. Too fast. Oh. Unfortunately, I guess the main problem is um, it's gonna be hard to. Save yourself if you fall. Yeah, most of the time you're pretty much. Cause you're gonna, cause once you fall over an edge, you're gonna instinctively want to go the other, and, hit, and try to move towards yeah. the edge. Cause you know, cause you have, you have a, gra a ledge grab. Yeah, the le ledge grabbing is like really precise in this game. Like, you only really grab the ledge, like that. I thought I was gonna grab the ledge. It's like stupidly precise. Is it, is it like melee grabbing ledges or something? It's, it's no, it's worse than that. Because oh, I, I can grab the ledge of melee, but in this game, it's like, you have to be at a certain, like, certain distance away, and it's... Wait, so you can't hug it? No, you can't. It doesn't work like that. Oh my god. That should not, that should not be how it works. Because nah. <laughs> like in melee, I just, yeah, I just hug, hug the side. I mean, I still don't like what Melee does with Legends because of the fact that you have to face the Legends. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad they fixed that in the other games. But nope, Prodded M wants to make sure that you face the Legends. Yeah. I, I can kind of understand like, like being more challenging in, those, like, in that kind of sense, but I don't really care. <laughs> but casuals wouldn't like it, that's for sure, yeah. and I'm a casual. I'm kind of an in-between. No. I mean, I will play competitive now and then, but... And when I really get into a game, I get mm. into a game. You know, actually, while we were looking at Rayman and, and talking about Smash, do you remember that leak, that fake leak? Like, a long I'm... time... Uh, oh, you... <laughs> I'm gonna dig my grave now. Well, you were upset about that being fake? I, f I went off the wall insane when they showed off the... Uh, when RC Omni showed the character select, I thought it was so real. I was so sad. But you thought it was legit. I f well, the thing is, what that picture that kind of told me it wasn't real was the uh, you could see Mewtwo on there, and before Mewtwo was even in this, released for those who got the And there's early. also the fact that he didn't play, uh, go on Rayman to have the announcer, so that, that's also that. Also, I yeah. screwed up. <laughs> <laughs> At least you got your picture taken. You yeah, think? I did. 
You almost did it again. <laughs> you almost. Oh, ice physics. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's almost. We're almost Ooh. done. Uh, let's see how long this video is. Like 10 more minutes. Uh, oh, only for, uh, 15. Oh, yeah. Alright then. And we're just gonna hit a very colorful level. Is there is the boss fight right after this one? Uh, maybe. How hard is Mr. Dark when we He's get there? He's what next to the final boss. Oh, we don't actually really fight him. Actually, it's more of a boss rush. But um, it's probably one of the easiest bosses in the game. But I do. I end up screwing it up for some reason. Ugh. <laughs> Hey, look, you got the right direction for once to start. No. <laughs> Over there's the secret flying thing that, like, sort of like in, uh, what was it, uh, Oh yeah, if you go, if you keep going to the left over, into the right over there, you actually go into the thing sort of like in, a uh, Wing Fortress zone. <laughs> you know that little uh, secret shortcut? Uh, sort of. Oh yeah! Like, you fall into a thing and then it just blows you through everything? Yeah! <laughs> But don't you have to take a hit though? Um, I don't remember. The last is last time I played Sonic Two. Well, it's not like Lewis is recording it for our channel, and for our commentary uh, channel. I hope Lewis doesn't watch this video. <laughs> oh. Ugh. That thing really comes fast. Beast. Yeah, I think the main issue is that um, Raymond's just not Raymond's just not agile enough to dodge these things. Did he fix your control right there, or, or something? Oh, uh, you can't stop moving. Now, oh right? yeah, this is the, you can't stop moving. Yeah, this is the uh, thing. It's actually actually kind of oh. like this one though. It's a fun little challenge. Yay! Kind of reminds me of. Uh, Secret rings. <laughs> No, no, there a level, a level, and uh, what? He just fixed No, control. that that's a. He basically made it so he can't punch. So, for the first like minute or so of this boss, you just have to avoid these uh, fire pillars. And, and you need that in order to get your punch yeah. back, right? And it actually comes pretty like. Whoa. Yeah, these things. It actually gets dangerously close. They see me like sh shuffling along. Also, I love this music so much. Oh, you hate. Oh. <laughs> oh, look, it is. I. I. Are those two things in the back. In, on the walls. Aren't those the bosses? Yeah, they are. The murals. Yep. I can't tell what the. You know, I'm just waiting for, I'm just waiting for Mr. Dark to, uh. Reverse your controls. That would suck. <laughs> You're doomed, Rayman. Yeah, there's a reason. What are yeah, you doing? Yeah, there's a reason for that. Because he does this. Oh god. Yeah, look how close this gets. And then he. Were you like pu pushing your head down or something? Yeah, so now it's a boss rush. What the. Does it redo the boss rush? Yep. Or is it no, the it's just the boss again? rush. I so we're gonna be here for a little while because I screw this part up quite a bit. Like it, it's usually really easy, but for some reason I got the rhythm off. Hell! Ah oh, man. I still like apparently you're you know you're hurting Mr. Dark off screen. But yeah, I honest. Oh, I just noticed. Wait, I just noticed when it when this thing came in, uh, those fixes in the wall yeah. flashed. That's nice. <laughs> Eep! What are you doing? Batman's like, what are you doing? I summon the power of the mural. Yeah, boy. 
Oh, he. I just realized he's a combination of two bosses. Like, there's um. He's Scorp, obviously. Yeah, yeah, the boss we fought earlier. But he's also he has the body of the uh, this rock boss. He bit. From the Fred world, I'm assuming. It's the Blue Mountains, I think. Yeah. Or well, the third picture is hmm. there. But it doesn't really mean anything because it only has a move that from the scorpion guy. I guess he can just defend himself. Hmm. I should think about it, he's weaker now since he doesn't need an energy blast to attack himself. To, to yeah, himself. we can hit him now. <laughs> What's up, bros? Yeah, boy. Yeah, like, I can usually do this two hits at once uh, uh, thing fine, but for some reason during this playthrough I just didn't get it right. This isn't this isn't supposed to be that hard, I swear. <laughs> there are two more bosses. Yeah, well it's it doesn't it's a lot better easier than it sounds. Oh I see what okay. So, Yeah, no, no, it, it's the thing I see now, like, um, the, uh, memorials are basically, like, the ones that shine are the bosses that are gonna combine. That's actually, that's so cool. I just wish you get, you actually fought Mr. Dark, because you don't really fight him. If you don't count, like, spin-offs, I guess, then yeah. Well, I mean, well, apparently he's in, like, some maths game or something. <laughs> I don't know, I just heard it on a... I, I, apparently, he's in some educational thing, because I just heard uh, Bay64 say something about it in a video. Yeah. So this is why this is this part is the easiest because I, you just do that. Yeah. This one isn't too. I don't even know. I don't know. It's just some random thing that happens. I don't know what he's combined with though. I don't know what this is supposed to be. Oh, he. No, I think he's. He's a mosquito, and he might also, he might, no, I think it's the, um, the, uh, saxophone as well. Yeah. I didn't hear you. Yeah. I don't know. It's also the hands as well. Yep. I don't, I don't know what that is. Yeah. Nope. You've done it. You've saved the world. <laughs> oh man. Yay. <laughs> yep, it just ends. <laughs> Well, at least you get an ending. Uh, Rayman Legends just stops. Mm -hmm. Sure. Uh. That's nice. Also, the uh. The pictures, this isn't uh, scripted by the way, the box moves randomly, so you you sometimes you'll just get like one or two pictures during this. It's a weird, kind of a weird way to do a credit scene. Mm. Well...
Oh, okay. Uh, but yeah, uh, Rayman 1, I, it's, um, it may be a hard game, but I still enjoy playing it. The uh, things I don't like would be the life system, uh, the uh, fact that you have to get all the cages to move to get to the final level, and the random randomly appearing uh, items and stuff like that. But other than that, I really like the music. I like the uh, the cartoony tone, and it's just again as hard as it can be. It's uh, still a fun game at its core, and I just enjoy playing it. But Well, <laughs> you don't know torture until you played Lost Levels in Zelda 2. Okay, what about Zelda 2? What about Zelda 2? No. I'm the complete opposite, because like, Rayman 1 is a hard game, but I think it's a fair hard for the most part. But... I can't say that with Lost Levels of Zelda 2. I... Hmm? Yeah, they do. But... I... There's everything in Zelda 2. Oh my gosh. No, no, it's like... this Again, this game is hard, but I don't think it's as bad as those games. Because it's still... It's like Super Meat Boy, where it's really balls to the wall hard, but it doesn't feel unfair. At least to me. Uh, there's also... Well, you say... Talk about uh, Persona and all that. Like... Those games, I, I haven't played them, but I'm assuming they'd be hard in different ways. No, I was saying, like, I don't, I haven't played Persona before, but I'm assuming, like, they'd be hard in, yeah, they're hard in different ways, because... Yeah, well, yeah, I'd exp yeah, because it's based on like the whole how the fighting gate uh, mechanics, the RPG elements work. Because like you're not exactly going to be doing precise platforming in a Persona game. At least I'm assuming you aren't. You, you I'm assuming you're not going to be doing like precise platforming in a Persona game. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So that's why. Yeah, that's why I'm talking. That's why I'm saying like it's a uh, hard in a different way because Rayman, Rayman One is not like that. It, it it depends on the genre. Like it's not the same kind of thing. Hmm. Yeah, exactly. Mm. But yeah, um, like I, I said this at the end of the um, at the end of the playthrough originally, um, where it's like if you want to if you want to get into harder platformers, I'd say this is a decent way to start. But I, I will say though, um, make yeah, be prepared, and if you don't care care about Cheating with lives, just do the 99 lives cheat because it will just save you a bunch of time. Mm. Yeah, um. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's no shame in that. Like, everyone. Literally, uh, after the first time I played this game, I. When, when I. 
whenever I see someone play or talking about Rayman or playing it or whatever, they all they always use the cheat, so there's no shame in it. Yeah, that one guy in the corner that is just like It's like my oh my ultimate achievement. <sighs> <laughs> that yeah yeah <laughs> oh man well anyways uh i think we should just stop it here so thanks for watching uh rayman one and i'll see you guys next time for whatever comes up so goodbye Bye. all right